Cash in a Digital Age? Making Deposits with Starling Ever find yourself with a lot of cash left over from that yard sale or a generous birthday gift? In today's increasingly digital world, it can feel strange holding physical money. But fear not. Even the most tech-savvy of us might need to deposit cash sometimes. So, the question is, can you ditch the dusty piggy bank and add that cash to your Starling account? The answer might surprise you. While Starling is a mobile-first bank, they've cleverly partnered with a network most of us already know and trust, the post office. That's right, with Starling, you can ditch the bank queues and deposit your cash at any of the 11,500 post office branches across the UK. That's more locations than all the banks and building societies combined. Now, let's dive into the details of making a cash deposit with Starling at the post office. The process is incredibly straightforward. First, gather your cash and head to your nearest post office. Don't worry if you can't remember where the closest one is, the Starling app has a handy built-in post office branch finder to help you out. Once you're at the counter, simply tell the post office worker you want to make a cash deposit to your Starling account. They'll likely ask you to show your debit card. Here's the clever bit, instead of handing over the cash directly, you'll insert your debit card into a secure pin pad machine. After entering your pin and confirming the amount you're depositing, poof! The cash gets electronically transferred to your Starling account. It's that quick and simple. But before you rush off to raid your piggy bank, there are a few things to keep in mind. Starling does have cash deposit limits to help prevent money laundering and ensure the safety of your account. For personal and joint accounts, you can deposit up to £1,000 completely free of charge each year. That's a decent chunk of change. However, if you go over that limit, a small fee of 0.7% will be applied to your deposit. There's also a daily deposit limit of £1,000, with a maximum of £250 of that being in coins. While Starling allows check deposits through the app for smaller amounts, the post office currently doesn't accept check deposits for Starling accounts. So if you have a check to cash, you'll need to use a different method. Overall, using the post office network for cash deposits with Starling is a convenient and secure way to add physical money to your digital account. It's perfect for those times when you receive cash or simply prefer the feel of physical money in your hands. So, there you have it. The answer is a resounding yes, you can absolutely deposit cash into your Starling account. With its extensive network of post office locations and a user-friendly deposit process, Starling makes managing your cash in a digital world a breeze. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.